Oh god. Don't look at me. I'm hideous. Oh my god. I'm a freaking pig. It's the worst thing ever. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Monster Hunter Pig World. Today we're going over a very quick little tip for those of you that are new to Monster Hunter World. This will be very beneficial to you. And it's very easy to use early game as well. This is called Mushroom Mancer. It's pretty freaking amazing. So what you can do is there's this little trick that you can use aside from your main set. When you first get into a zone, you can actually equip some uh, armor that uses this skill, which is the Mushroom Mancer. Uh, so we've got it level two on the mush uh, on the moss wine mask alpha here and what the mushroom mancer skill does is let you digest mushrooms that would otherwise be inedible and gain their advantageous effects so this is very cool and a lot of things i'm going to show you right now will last for your entire quest until you die so if you do happen to die you can go ahead and just re-equip the uh, mushroom mancer stuff and then redo all of this so a couple things here we'll go over the parish room here which will give you a defense boost. So this is an armor skin. Now this will last for the entirety of the quest. And then you can go ahead and use Devil's Blight, which is the dash juice, which will also last the entire fight, which is amazing. So that will have the amount of stamina that you use per action, which is very amazing. Now the blue mushroom is actually a potion um, and it's very, very quick to eat. So you can actually include the set into any real set that you want to do. It does come in gems. Unfortunately, I don't have any of the gems to show off for you. I'm, I'm jewels or decorations, whatever you want to call them. Uh, you can get them that way as well. And you can incorporate this into any set. Uh, the blue mushrooms is just a health potion. Then you've got the Mandragora, which is a max potion. So you'll see we'll eat that real quick. And then we'll get the boost to 150 health because uh, the food that I ate didn't have that. And then, um, actually 165 because I have Vitality Gems. Then we've got the Nitro Shroom. Guess what this is? Attack boost, ladies and gentlemen. Now this will work for the entirety of the fight as well. So those three things will work for the entirety of the fight. You can use an Excite Shroom. I wouldn't recommend it. Sometimes it's good, sometimes it's bad. But it's usually just one of the effects that you get anyways. Let's go ahead and eat it and see what we get this time. It's completely random. You never really know what you're going to get. Looks like it was a defense up, which we already had. So yeah, uh, but the real ones that you want to eat are the night. Oh God, the nitro shroom, uh, the devil's blight, and the parish shroom. This will give you attack up, defense up, and have the amount of stamina that you have to use during the quest. So it's like, very amazing for literally every single class. And then once you go ahead and eat that, you can just go into your tent. You can swap to your main equipment real quick, and you'll see that we actually keep all of the buffs that we got from the mushroom mancer so we'll go ahead and go out of here and you'll see that we continue to retain all of our attack all of the defense and the dash juice as well which is freaking amazing it's just a little not necessarily a hack it's meant to be in the game but a lot of people don't know about it uh, a lot of the veterans you will know this but you guys got to remember that there's a whole bunch of people now being introduced to the game and a lot of these little tips will help so anyways i hope you guys all enjoyed this quick little episode it's nice so anytime that you die you can literally just go back uh equip the those two pieces of equipment or whatever you need to get the full level of mushroom mancer and then get your nice little attack boost now this does stack with the might pill as well so you can go ahead and eat a might pill you'll see that we're at 294 attack right now you can eat the might pill and that will stack so we have a uh, 326 damage I, I sorry it's not the might pill that stacks it is the actual powders that stack there we go so the might pill and the adamant pill actually overwrite because they're, they're significantly stronger uh, but if we eat, I'll go ahead and use this demon powder the demon powder does stack along with everything else. So we have 307 attack now, and then uh, we can go here. The life powder. That's the that's not life. <laughs> I meant to use the hard shell powder. There we go. 
and now our defense is at 444 which is pretty freaking awesome so um you can go ahead and use these when you're out and to get the stacks of the attack and defense it's pretty nice so it's definitely something that you want to use there's really no reason not to unless you don't want to spend the time just to go into your tent and switch armor pieces but it's pretty beneficial i hope you guys all enjoyed it i'm actually working on building a lord of the mushrooms sword and shield build which is absolutely amazing it's going to be wide range and mushroom mancer if you guys want to check that out it's gonna be freaking amazing we just spent the stream farming it up and this will allow you to be pretty much the best support that you can possibly get in the game instant healing or crisis healing it's insane you can completely buff your entire party and it just makes things go so much faster so keep an eye out for that on the channel if you are new don't forget to subscribe and if you found this video helpful or at least fun to watch smash that like button and i'll see you all in the next one Bye bye